Great day, great day, great day. I know I have not been on YouTube in a while. And it and uh, guys, it looked like they took away my live streaming. I don't know with all of these updates. I'm trying to get connected back on. But anywho, I just wanted to come up here with my Wednesday truth. It looks like, you know, um, because we do things different, people think that they're wrong. They're not necessarily wrong. They're just different. We were all created differently. And so my difference is not going to look like what you're doing, right? Just, you know, people say common sense, but I don't think it's common because common isn't common for everybody, right? But because I do it differently does not mean I do it wrong. I just do it different. We create it differently, right? First Peter 2, 9 talks about, um, we're a chosen generation, a holy nation, um, a royal priesthood, you know, a peculiar people. And we go forth and show forth our praises, right? But the thing about that is it says that we're peculiar. We're strange as we want to be. So we're going to be uncommon and un unlike anybody else. We're peculiar. God made us that way, right? Um, just grab hold of that identity, that identity difference and be who you are, right? Embrace your difference. I identify with my difference, right? I'm always doing things off or thinking a little bit. My thinking is just a little bit tweaked from everyone else's. And I'm okay with that, right? Because I wasn't, you know, when we were growing up, there was something called dare to be different. You know, don't try to be like everybody else. Be you, be you, be you. And so that kind of got embedded in me. So now I don't have to, which it was, a, it was a good thing, but you know, um, I've always been able to dare to be different, not having to, um, be like other people just to be a part of something, right? Um, sticking to who I am and being able to truly identify with who I am and not being able to be, um, having to be clickish. I guess it would, I guess you would be clickish, right? I don't know. But um, just being able to be comfortable with who I am. That's what I'm looking for. Being comfortable with who I am enough to be able to say, you know what? This is who I am. This is it. Um, and, and, and don't get me wrong, not saying that I shouldn't continue to be growing and developing in certain areas because sometimes people get stuck in a place of, oh, you ought to be all right with this. Cause this is who I am. This is who I am. And, and they, they're not growing. They're not developing. They're not changing things for the better. That's not what I'm saying. What I'm saying is your, I, your difference, um, what you bring to the table is good enough, right? Your difference is good enough. You don't have to be a, a, a copy in order to be able to measure up. Your difference is good enough. So just be different today. Be walking your truth. Be who you are. Be proud of who you are. If there's some growth and development areas, please make sure that you take control of those and you go into developing those. I'm developing. I'm still developing, you know, even at the age that I am, I'm still finding things that I can um, develop in and grow in areas that I can grow in. But I embrace my difference. I embrace who I am. I embrace my makeup. I am comfortable with where I am. So guys, I dare you to go out and embrace your difference today. All right. You make it great. And I'll see you back on YouTube sooner than this time. Right. Bye. Toodles.